Hey, it's Jennifer Sparks with Afternoon in Connecticut, and today I am in Mesquamac at Rhode Island. I know it's Rhode Island, but it's very close. <laughs> We're going to be having lunch at the Andrea today. I often hear people ask, like, where can I go for lunch and then go take a walk on the beach after? This place is great. For more videos about Connecticut and towns around it, please subscribe to my channel. Our visit to the Andrea was early June. It was after Memorial Day, so the restaurant is open in full swing. It is open seasonally. Reservations are recommended. We are here on a Wednesday. It's about 3 o'clock in the afternoon, so we were able just to walk right in. They also have parking there. You can make a reservation to park your car and enjoy the beach for the day. That's a very cool thing about Mesquamica Beach is anybody could go there. You could be from Connecticut or Massachusetts or anywhere. You don't have to be, you know, live in that town to go to Mesquamica Beach. The Andrea has inside and outside dining. We chose to sit outside because it was a beautiful day and look at our view. We didn't park at the Andrea because we were staying at Ocean Club at Atlantic Beach. There is a look at Pleasant View Inn, which is also in walking distance. The Andrea is definitely like a destination place. You know, I wasn't expecting much from the food because it's a place you go for a great view and a great experience, but the food was really good. I, we both, me and my husband were there, really enjoyed our dinners. If you want to see more about Westerly and Mesquamica Beach, I will leave some playlists at the end of this video. Say hey to my husband, Kelly. I love to come to Mesquamica at least twice a year. Uh, I've made other videos about the beach and the resort that I stay at. So if you want to see more information, I'm going to leave that for you at the end of the video. You just click on the playlist and it'll take you right to the video. But right now I'm going to take you for a walk around the beach and I'm going to show you what it's like around the Andrea. Those of you that don't know, Mesquamica Beach is on the Atlantic Ocean and has waves. It's also wonderful to walk on. It's very flat. There's some rocks and some beautiful shells to look at and pick through, but other than that, it really is a beautiful, simple, relaxing walk. It's actually pretty easy to walk on barefoot. I'm not going to show it in this video, but the way we're walking, if you keep walking, you're going to hit a state beach. Well, there's parking there too, but there's also concessions and bathrooms, which is important if you're going there to camp out there to, for the day with the family. It's nice to know that, you know, there's, you know, bathrooms, there's a playground if you have kids. I'll leave information about the state beach in the description below. Just check it out. It'll be, you know, the rules and policies over there. And also, as always, in all my videos, if you want to add any information, I don't live there. I'm not an expert on Western or Mesquamacate. I just love it. I think it's great. <laughs> so I'm doing the best I can to describe it. But I always love hearing from my viewers. So if you want to add anything to this or if I'm saying something wrong, please feel free. Leave me a message in the comments. I'd love to, you know, I learn from my viewers. It's awesome. And if you do like Connecticut and you want to see more, please subscribe to my channel. That would be awesome. Coming up ahead, we're going to be seeing some residential houses, some motels, and then finally we're going to get to Patty's Beach Bar. Thank you so much for hanging with me. Enjoy the walk on the beautiful Mesquamica Beach in Westerly, Rhode Island.